Welcome to Football Navigator as we take a look at one of the most successful defensive midfielders South Africa has ever produced in Kakiso Dikashu. But before we resume, if you're new to this channel, please do subscribe as well as pressing the notification button so that you don't ever miss out on Football Navigator's latest content. Kakisho Evidence Dikashu was born on the 24th of November 1984, meaning as of 2021 he is 37 years old. The former Fulham superstar is married to Karina Mikechin and the two have a son and a daughter. Mr. Dikashu married the gorgeous Miss Dikashu in a secret wedding ceremony which was held in Switzerland in 2016. The beautiful Miss Dikashu is a fashionista who runs her own fashion website called Fashion SOS. And looking at Dikashu's wife, you can simply tell that the player is of class and good taste. The former Bafana Bafana midfielder has ventured into coaching since returning to South Africa a few years ago and it is unclear whether KG has shipped his car collection with him to South Africa. While around the streets of London, he drove a luxurious Mercedes-Benz C63, a Bentley Continental as well as a Range Rover which was spotted with the Rover body kit. KG was proud to show off his prized assets and often shared them to his followers on social media. However, these days he is a bit more conservative and opts for humor rather than showcasing his lifestyle. While his wife has also been spotted driving a BMW X6 as well as a Bentley Continental in South Africa. Throughout his career, Kakisho Dikashu represented some of the biggest teams in the world, including Fulham, Crystal Palace, and Cardiff City in England. During his playing days, Kakisho Dikashu was one of the highest paid South African football players. His estimated net worth in 2020 was around 72 million rands. Beside Football Navigator's extensive research on Kakiso Dikashu's house, the player has not shared any snaps or glimpses of his house on social media, but you can rest assured that Football Navigator will keep an eagle eye on the matter. Kakiso Dikashu began his playing career at local club Cardiff Space. That is before moving to Golden Arrows in 2005 as a little known holding midfielder from lower league side Bloemfontein Young Tigers. At Golden Arrows, he developed into the country's best players in his position and was subsequently rewarded with the captain's armband. On the 4th of August 2009, Dikashu announced that he had reached an agreement with Fulham after a successful trial at the club. The deal was only finalized on the 26th of August due to work permit being not granted. Dikashu had trained with his former club Golden Arrows while paperwork process took place in order to maintain fitness. He made his debut on the 4th of October but was sent off on the 41st minute when he slept Scott Parker. After appearing only once for Fulham under Marquise in 2010-2011 season, Dikashu was allowed to drop down a division and join Crystal Palace in February on loan until the end of the season. He scored his first goal for Crystal Palace against Cardiff City on the 8th of March 2011 before moving permanently to Crystal Palace on the 4th of July 2011 for a fee of about £600,000. On the 12th of June 2014, Dikashu signed a three-year deal with Cardiff City after refusing a new deal with Crystal Palace. He made his debut in a 1-0 loss to Wolverhampton Wanderers on the 23rd of August. 
His full debut came three days later in a League Cup where Cardiff City beat Port Vila. The following season, a series of niggling injuries meant that Kakiso Dikashu was ruled out for four months with a knee injury. Dikashu did not return until the following season where he started the opening day against Fuller. He made 25 appearances during the season as Cardiff missed out on the playoffs before his contract was terminated by Mushal Contest in August 2016. In October 2016, Dikashu signed a short-term deal with Lamontville Golden Arrows of South Africa after training with the team following his release from Cardiff City. As a result of injuries and weight issues, he played in just 10 matches and failed to complete a match. Golden Arrows announced in June 2017 that he would no longer return to the club the following season. Dikashu made his international debut on the 27th of May 2007 in a Kosafa Cup match against Mauritania. He scored his first two goals on the 7th of June in a 2010 World Cup qualifier against Equatorial Guinea. He was also part of the Bafana Bafana setup in the 2008 African Cup of Nations squad and was also a participant in the 20. 09 FIFA Confederations Cup as well as the 2010 FIFA World Cup. He also represented Bafana Bafana in the 2013 African Cup of Nations.